Coming up, it's scandal versus scandal in the neck and neck race for the U.S. Senate in Virginia. And later in this broadcast, the valiant but so far vain attempt to clean up Houston's San Jacinto River. And riding high with the fastest falling woman in the world. World News Sunday, brought to you by Cotton Incorporated. Finally, a look at a woman who dances on air. Dale Stewart is an aerospace engineer with a doctorate from MIT, who despite a splendid education, chooses to spend her life jumping out of airplanes. She hurdles toward Earth at 120 miles an hour, performing a 50-second routine that borrows from gymnastics and borders on ballet. One, two. There are a lot of parallels between dance and ballet on the ground and what I do in the air. And people who watch the performances then say, oh, wow, that looks like ballet. <laughs> Stewart performs so gracefully and athletically that last Sunday in the skies above Phoenix, Arizona, she won the Women's World Freestyle Skydiving Championship for the fifth year in a row. At the age of 35, Dale Stewart is the only world champion her high-flying sport has ever had. I'm very aware of the fact that I'm falling at speeds over 100 miles an hour straight towards the earth. But for those 50 seconds, I know that I don't have to be concerned about that. I'm on a stage. The air, the whole air, the whole sky is my stage. Clearly, Dale does not suffer from stage fright. The air acts like a, a supporting force. It's actually like lying on a soft water bed. 3,000 feet from the ground, Stuart opens her parachute floats down. This isn't a question of tempting fate, not the way Dale does it anyway. She doesn't take any risks with this. Well, not many anyway. And if Dave Stewart has any worries about his wife, he has no one to blame but himself. He introduced her to the sport at MIT. His third jump was her first. And I could tell just with one look at her face after she landed that she was hooked on the sport right, right at that moment. Dave took only one jump after that. Dale has taken 3,600 more. Uh, but there is definitely a slow airspeed. I'm dropping a little uh -huh. more. Ray Cottingham is Stewart's partner, her cameraman. The sport is judged from videotape. The judges do not free fall next to the competitors. The quality of the tape is graded, as well as the quality of the dive. I've got to move camera right, camera left. I've got to have an up angle, down angle. I've got to move in. She's going to fall fast. All this has got to be going through your mind. At the same time, you've got to be keeping track of the elements that you're in. In other words, what your altitude is. Cunningham and Stewart work close to each other, but not too close. We've never collided. We've never had even a scary episode in, in approximately 1,900 jumps together. Ah! Pull your they work separately, too. Dale, for instance, was a stunt double for Nastasia Kinski in the film Terminal Velocity. Cottingham, who is 54, was the cameraman who captured the flying Elvises in the film Honeymoon in Las Vegas. You don't have to be Elvis to skydive. You do have to have a vision. There's just a, a wide open horizon we can head towards. There's no limits to what we can do. Sort of Pavlova with a parachute. Carol? Dick, that was truly incredible.